Another creator recently found both of these contaminants added to their water after filtering it through another water drop product, the A1 countertop reverse osmosis system. So I specifically wanted to test to see if we saw the same issue with the X12. Luckily, neither dichloromethane nor xylanes were detected in our filtered water. That said, 0 0.00299 parts per million of antimony was detected in the filtered water where it hadn't been in the unfiltered water. These concentrations exceeded TAPSCORE's HGL of 0 0.001 parts per million by 195 Antimony is a metal and exposure primarily through inhalation has been shown to cause negative effects on the liver, blood, and blood sugar regulation. One hypothesis is that the antimony was introduced by the filters themselves or the internal plumbing of the system. It's often used as a catalyst in the production of certain plastics, including PET. I found several studies that observed antimony leaching into water, including a 2008 study in the journal Water Research that detected between 0 0.095 to 0 0.521 parts per billion of antimony in nine commercially available bottled waters in the US. I reached out to Waterdrop and they assured me that the internal components the water comes into contact with, including the filter housings and plumbing, are made of polypropylene, not PET. Now I couldn't find any data or studies that confirmed antimony as a catalyst in polypropylene production. 